Days after he was booked for first carrying out a procession in a communally sensitive area despite being denied permission, which later resulted in a riot-like situation, and then for leading a mob to attack the SSP residents, the BJP MP Raghav Lakhanpal from Saharanpur remains unapologetic and defiant. He claims it was the cops who failed to protect the procession. We know what the procession was for, but the, the fact is you didn't have the permission and if as an MP you didn't have permission, why did you go ahead? No, I, I, uh, getting, a, getting the permission is not my job. Uh, it's, it's the people who were organizing it. It was their uh, duty to get the permission done and they did put the papers in for the permission, but the local administration disallowed it at the last minute and uh, the, the procession started to move and they didn't give any particular reason. You see, it wasn't a religious procession. You have to understand that. Uh, Baba Sahib, Dr. Bhimrao Ambedkar does not belong to any one community. He was awarded the Bharat but it Ratna. Doesn't, He's again, the person who gave this it's country not its about, constitution. It's not about the fact uh, of whether Baba Sahib Ambedkar belongs to a community or not, but the fact is that you made these very, very strong statements against a senior police official. You said that this police is not a job. They have put their hands in their hands. Captain jo hai, Love Kumar, ye ek bakwas admi hai. You're saying this as an MP of the ruling party against a senior police official. The police ran away. The police uh, officers ran away from the scene in front of me. The police ran away. The police ran away in, in front of my own eyes. They ran away from the scene and they left all the villagers and myself and everyone else uh, without any security, without uh, anything, and they just ran away from there. I mean, they were they were not even prepared prepared to handle uh, the goons. The goons that were throwing stones, they were hurling bricks, they were throwing acid bombs, they were firing in the air. But you actually went, you actually went to the police official's house. You stood on his front porch and launched a tirade against him. Isn't this disgraceful? An MP, an MP is entitled, an MP is entitled, and in fact, it is his duty to visit the camp office or the office of uh, the, the SSP in case law and order breaks down or in case people's issues have not been addressed. The camp office is, is in the residential uh, complex. The residence is behind the camp office. So you need to actually uh, go to the go to the place to understand that no one even ventured near the residence. And I, I you, you must ch you listen. The SSP. I, th I think you you need to know this. You need to know this now that the SSP has given a letter saying that his all that was mentioned by a particular newspaper saying that you know his wife and children were terrified is all wrong he gave a letter uh, clearing that immediately after this was published but can i just ask you do you have any sense of regret for your actions i i i, I really i really feel a sense of uh, regret that we have uh, such a bad local uh, district administration that was unable to uh, secure the people when they were put at risk by, by a, gro a group of uh, hoodlums. So you don't apologize for your actions at all? Apologize for what? Apologize for standing uh, with people when they were being attacked? Apologize for questioning the administration when they were not performing? Uh, it's not a question of the, the, the administration needs to apologize for not being able to protect the people. So many people were injured.